if I were to able to take the time that I took with weights and put it towards CrossFit at the time, you'd be, you'd, you'd be indestructible. We had Bill Grunler on and we were talking yeah. wrestling, just like we we're talking wrestling with you. And he said, he thinks CrossFit is the best strength and conditioning for wrestling. Do you agree with that statement? And do you have 100%. your kids? Do you have your kids do it for their wrestling? Oh yeah. I just right out right on the other side of this wall is an enormous uh, it's a three car garage. It's all a garage gym. And my kids go out there pretty regularly. I just heard one go out there um to go get their session on. And my it's absolutely, I mean, if I knew about CrossFit when I was um, a young buck, I would have been a monster, an absolute monster, you know, because it was just kind of like I ran, like I ran all the time in my high school years. And that was something that like, I wish I did a lot more as I got to be a bigger weight guy. You know, I wrestled 184 and I didn't run as much as I should have, to tell you the truth, but I used to run a lot, but I never really put a lot of the stuff together is like wrestle weight lift traditionally right traditional weight lift like curls and tricep push downs and dips and that kind of stuff but like never were we ever like combining all of that stuff so that you got into like an anaerobic state where there were compound movements right and you did that when you're wrestling especially when you had good wrestling partners like dougie eastlick or chris brisky or you know, some of these older, older guys, right? But like, if I were to able to take the time that I took with weights and put it towards CrossFit at the time, you'd be, you'd, you'd be indestructible. I mean, you really would because it's conditioning at the same time, strength training and, and you're doing it in an anaerobic work state, which is pretty much all of wrestling, except for the first three seconds of the match. <laughs> you know it, but yeah it's 100 and i highly recommend um wrestling coaches or and or any strength and conditioning coaches to go to a level one crossfit level one seminar spend the money or have your act you know your your school fund it but like you learn an enormous amount around fitness and exercise like crossfit seems like a bunch of crazy people throwing weights over their head or swinging things or doing crazy stuff. But I'll tell you that what Greg Glassman had built and packaged in a very like, um, just a very digestible way, number one, but it's all backed by physics and kinematics and biomechanics and, and real science, like real science. And and what they've done is they packaged it in a way where someone goes, why have I been training these other ways all this time? And so coaches out there, if you want to have monster boys and monster gals, or you want to be a monster yourself, go to a CrossFit level one, learn it, take notes, bring it back, package it for your kids. It will be, you'll, it'll pay back in spades spades.